Good morning and welcome to our week of prayers. Let us pray. Dear Jesus, please help us to do our part. Please bless my mommy, my daddy, my, my brother, and all the parents and all the children. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Alive Again Memory Gem. Look, Jesus is coming with the clouds. Everyone will see him, even those who stabbed him, and all peoples of the earth will cry loudly because of him. Yes, this will happen. Amen. Revelation 1 verse 7. Mama, Carlos, Grandpa is very sick. And they don't think he will live more than two days, said Paul sadly. Yes, dear, death is a terrible thing, said Mama softly. It's sad to lose a loved one. I see Carlos and Bailey crying a lot whenever they talk about their grandpa, Paul, explained to Mama. Don't feel so sad. There's hope for all of us, explained Mama joyfully. Tell your friends. What kind of hope is there after you die? Said Paul with a puzzled look. The Bible tells us that Jesus will come again to wake those who have died in him, Mama said enthusiastically. Let's look up 1 Thessalonians 4, verse 16 and 17 to read more about this wonderful promise. Great, Mama, exclaimed Paul. The Lord himself will come down from heaven. There will be a loud command with the voice of the archangel and with the trumpet call of God. And those who have died and were in Christ will rise first. After that, those who are still alive at that time will be gathered up with them. We will be taken up in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. And we will be with the Lord forever. 
want to share this quote with Carlos Sembelin. Wow, it says here that those who have died in Christ will rise first, and those who are still alive will be taken up to meet Jesus in the air, said Paolo excitedly. Then Carlos and Belling don't have to cry anymore, said Paolo confidently. So go and share this wonderful news with your friends tomorrow, Mama encouraged with a smile on her face. Friends, boys and girls, teachers and parents, Jesus is coming again and death will be no more. Isn't this joyful? Isn't this great news? Doesn't this give us hope? Aren't you happy? I am happy and I know it. So I will say amen. Just as Carlos and Bailey We'll see their grandpa again, so we will see our past loved ones. Lord, we await your return. Live it out activity for today. Pray together with your parents and or with two friends for those who have lost loved ones, that they will trust Jesus' promise of seeing them again. You can decorate six index cards with Bible text that gives the hope of resurrection when Jesus comes again. And share it out with those persons who have lost their loved ones so you can encourage them to keep the faith and that Jesus is coming soon. Let us pray. Dear Jesus, we want to thank you for always keeping your promises. We ask that you may be with those who have lost loved ones, that you may send the Holy Spirit to comfort them at this time. Help them to know that you are still God and you are in control. Bless and keep us safe in Jesus' name. Amen.